Hiya. Um, so I was working with a new client yesterday and at the end of the session they said um, that they'd really enjoyed it um, but that they had been really anxious about coming um, because they hadn't known what to expect from um, a one-to-one -one training session and they'd really been quite um, uptight and, and worried about it. So I thought well if they're feeling like that there might be other people feeling like that so I thought I'd do a quick video just to give you an idea of what a one-to-one -one session with me looks like um, and to kind of reassure you that it's not scary and uh, you don't need to worry about it if you are. Um, so um, if we are working at one of the parks that I use and it's the first time that we have uh, worked together I'll send you an email in advance giving you details about where to meet me and what to bring um, and I'll tell you to leave your dog in the car and I'll come and find you. And when I do, we'll have a quick chat just to recap on what you want to work on with your dog, a wee quick catch up on how things have been going and um, just give us a chance to introduce ourselves. Um, then we'll get your dog out of the car and your dog might be a bit jumpy, a little bit frantic, especially if they're in a new place. Um, they might be a little bit vocal. They might try to jump up on me. That's all totally fine. Um, and nothing for you to worry about. Um, what we'll do then is we'll just go into the park and we'll just have, go for a walk for five or ten minutes just to say to your dog, give him a chance to kind of get his bearings, have a sniff, go for a pee if he needs to. Um, we'll just have a chat and it um, just gives you a chance to settle as well. Then we will start to work on some really simple stuff. Um, Things like lead handling, um, things like the pace that we're moving at, things like observing your dog's body language. Um, nothing, nothing uh, challenging to start with. And then we will um, move through the plan that we have for the session um, and adapt that as we go. There are no expectations on you or your dog's abilities or capabilities. Um, the reason you've come to me is because you need some help or you want some guidance. Um, so there, I have absolutely no expectations of any kind of minimum standards. So people sometimes get a bit anxious or a bit embarrassed if their dog's pulling on the lead or their dog's jumping up or um, their dog's barking uh, or not responding to cues. So if, if people maybe ask their dog to sit and their dog doesn't, they get all embarrassed um, and can try to explain it away. It's totally fine. There are no expectations on you, no pressure on you, no pressure on your dog. Um, because that's not how I train. Um, I want you to feel relaxed and happy when we're out together. So if you're thinking that you might want to investigate training, but you are a bit apprehensive or unsure, I hope that's given you some reassurance. Um, we move at your pace, at your dog's pace at all times. There are no expectations on you, no pressure on you. It should be relaxed. It should be interesting and hopefully it should be fun as well. Um, and yeah, so any questions, any feedback, um, anything you want to ask about how one-to-one -one training works, then pop them in the comments below and I'll be happy to answer them. Um, I hope you are all safe and well and coping with the restrictions that some of us are currently living under. Um, hopefully the end's in sight, but I um, hope you are all well and take care and I'll speak to you soon. Thanks a lot. Bye.